I'm Emre from uh, Institute of Photonic Sciences. We are located in Barcelona and we are making graphene-based wearable sensors. This one that I'm holding is a smart medical patch that you can attach to your skin and obtain some information about your vital signs. Uh, this one is specific for UV uh, exposure so that when, when you're going to beach you just stick in your stick stick on your skin and you can check how much time you need to stay under sun. So my friend is actually wearing it on the arm. Mark can help us. Yeah. This is an actually working device. So we have an artificial sun here. What's good about this device is when you just bring your phone close to the sensor, it makes an NFC connection. You will you will see it. It just automatically uh, connects with the phone. But what what's more is it's actually used the power of your phone. This thing has no battery in it. And when we turn on the our artificial sun, it will tell us how much time we need to spend on the sun. In this harsh condition, we have only 10 minutes left. So we need to go out. As you see, it's changing when we are getting close to source and... Yep. So it, it's powered by... It's powered, no, RFID. It's, it's from the sun. And no, no it, battery. It's, it's antenna of the phone. There's okay. uh, RFID here. It's a near field communication, and it just powers your patch, and also it takes the data from your patch. So it's two-way communication, and we are aiming for a comp compact uh, product that can show you six different vital signs, which is namely uh, heartbeat, pulse oxygenation, hydration, temperature, UV monitoring, and breath sensor. So. We, are, we can measure them individually for each sensor, but then the system integration is not ready yet. It's going to take a couple of years to be on the market with this device. And it's going to look like a tattoo, a real tattoo, that is totally flexible, stretchable and uh, transparent. And yet, do you go as far as to figure out a price point for... Uh, we are, this, is really, this is really low cost to fabricate. That's the main idea, so that it's gonna be disposable and you can stick on your skin and when you take shower and go into water, you can just get rid of it and stick any one. And we made a rough cost estimation. It's gonna be presented as a bunch of sensors, like 100. And in this case, the price per device is around uh, actually one euro. So One euro. And, and what kind of graphene are you using to... It's, it's chemical vapor deposited graphene. Okay. And we have another light absorbing layer on top. Uh, our intellectual property here is we know how to integrate this sensor on any kind of uh, flexible circuit board. So we are using an evolutionary kit from Texas Instrument and we are integrating our sensor on top of it to use it as a patch. Okay, and, and the, the phone that it works with, it doesn't need any, is there any RFID it's, it's just a standard radio frequency? Phone. Here is a Motorola with an Android, it's just a standard phone. If you have an NFC on your phone, that's it. Right. But for the next model, it will require a data storage and you will need a battery for that. What is the benefit of having a patch versus uh, sort of in the clothing? Uh, some people really doesn't like to stick it on the arm, but it's really easy to wear on the cloth. We can make it very small. This is just for demonstration purpose. Right. You can just attach it to your swimsuit and enjoy the sun bathing. Right. There's no difference. Right. Okay. And uh, would you? Are you going to work with anybody in developing this, or is this? Uh, we have some collaboration on making mass production, but the so since we are still working on the ultimate product, it's taking uh, some time. So it's still not yet ready. All right. Great.